Israeli authorities demolished 10 Palestinian homes Tuesday in the city of Kalanswa in central Israel, claiming they were built without permits. Eyewitnesses said that clashes broke out between police officers and the homeowners who tried to stop the Israeli bulldozers from razing their structures. We are very much concerned with these Israeli practices which contradict the minimum Palestinian human rights. The Israeli occupation continuously seeks the displacement of Palestinians inside the Green Line in an attempt to reduce the Palestinian presence inside the Green Line to the minimum and to prevent their control on the Palestinian resources inside the Green Line. Uh, Meanwhile, Mayor Abdel Basit Mansour visited the site and announced that he would resign from his post in protest of the Israeli major. Last month, Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu instructed officials to issue demolition orders for illegal structures located in the Arab towns in northern and southern Israel, as well as in East Jerusalem. According to Palestinian human rights group Adala, the Palestinian population in Israel needs about 13,000 new housing units each year. However, only 7,000 are built. Illegal buildings are widespread in Arab communities in Israel due to Israel's systemic policy, which strictly limits granting building permits for Arab citizens of Israel since 1948. Nuhar Bazin, TV, Palestine.